Good morning. I'm going to show you how to plug your RC3 into a computer. It's important you follow this order. You put a blank jack socket into your RC3. You then plug the power in and then you plug the correct connector into the back of your RC3 going to a USB to your computer and you will hear it's all lit up for computer and you can see it's all good to go and I will show you what it looks like on the screen in a second but I'll show you this again it's really simple to connect it to the computer it's not hard it's jack plug connected to nothing I call it a blank jack plug your power socket and the correct connection to a USB to your computer will all light up if it doesn't you go again plug it into the computer and there you go computer it's that simple so it's a blank jack plug anyway I will show you what the screen looks like right now this is how it comes up your boss RC3 which is there so you click on Roland it's what it is you can click on WAV and these are all your tracks so if you're downloading files as a backup track here I've got the shadows riders in the sky they have to be WAV tracks WAVE sound MPEGs or any other type of type of track will not work so basically when you've got that track you just drag it along and put it in the file and I will show you this in a second okay now what I've got here and I'll show you is my uh, Roland as it's called which is the RC3 it's called Roland on the computer now I know I want to put my next song into Space 66 which I don't have anything in now what I've done is I've downloaded the MP3 guitar backing track to Fortunate Sum, which is the next thing I'm going to do. I've next converted it into a WAV file because that's what you have to use when you use the RC3. And you just drag it across, like so. Simple enough. Now you can see it's a WAV file, can you see there? Shows me there WAV. Now what I do is I check it works. And you can see it does. So that's it so I've got that and I obviously I've got to write down on a piece of paper it's 66 the same as Francis Farmer which is the last track I did which if you search for that on my YouTube channel you will see exactly how it works and that's basically it and then all you do is you just disconnect your RC3 from the computer unplug the jack the power plugs everything I'll do it show you now and everything will disappear and that's it good to go thank you okay what I'm going to show you is how you plug your RC3 in so you can play backing tracks to an amplifier the first thing you do is you simulate a guitar with just a blank jacking plug you put that in A the connection to the amp you put here on output A this here is my channel shifter plug which most of you probably will not have and then you plug the power in and it will light up so as I say this over a little bit there we go a blank guitar, a blank jack plug into A. This goes to your amplifier. 
that's my channel shifter which you will see there I hold it down to go back and there's my power and what I'll do is I'll plug it put it all on and you'll hear it see it's as easy as that now I put my backing tracks for a Marshall AS50D which is a transistor acoustic amp which I find is best for doing this I've got an orange tiny terror black star valve amps I find do not work for me anyway I hope this has been helpful and keep enjoying playing your guitar thank you <laughs>